Welcome to AppShrink.com video reviews. Today we'll be taking a look at a new iPad application that makes sending e-cards on the iPad a breeze. It's called eCard Express, so let's go ahead, dive in, and take a closer look. When you first open the application, you're presented with a convenient interface. You have your categories on the left side and thumbnails for each category on the right side. By default, the frames category is open, so let's go ahead and browse through some frames. There's quite a variety. This is a collection of all the frames from all the different categories, like St. Patrick's Day. You have some random flower frames. And there is obviously just the frames. There's some palm trees over here. Let's go ahead and choose this one. And choose a photo. There we go. Very nice. You could pinch and zoom to adjust the photo size. Place it accordingly. Let's add some text. Let's make this a happy birthday card. Go ahead and type in some text. There it is. Let's change the font to something a little bit more fun. Change the color to match the card. And there we go. You could preview the card with the preview function right here. This is what the card will look like to the recipient. It's a very convenient feature. If you have more text, it would obviously be scrollable. You could add some more stickers. There's a variety to choose from. Since it's a birthday, let's uh, go ahead and pick a cake. You could also pinch and zoom to adjust the size, place it accordingly. There we go. If you don't like the cake, which I don't really think it suits the mood, you could go ahead and delete it with the X and choose a better cake like this one. There we go. So there it is. And you could share this card with email, Facebook, and Twitter. Or you could choose to save it to my cards. Go ahead and tap that. And the number will indicate how many saved cards you have for each category. So let's go ahead and jump into there. My cards. As you can see, I've already created a few. This is convenient if you don't have an internet connection and uh, you could save a bunch of cards and share them when you do have internet. Just like that. Since Easter is coming up, let's take a look at some of the Easter cards. It's very easy to make a card, so why don't we go ahead and make an Easter card. There we go. Change the font to a little bit something more exciting. Just like that. And it's ready to share. eCard Express is definitely one of the best ways to share an eCard with friends, family, business partners. eCard Express.